Hello there, Karan here. And in this video, we will talk about uh, some new patch plugins that I have created. So let's have a look at them. And uh, this is add line, delete line, read line, and replace line plugins. Basically, they all are created in C. And there is b.txt. Okay, this is just a test file that we created while I was testing this with Anik. And uh, here you can see it's they are very really small plugins they are compiled with tcc i think and this is created in c so 3.5 kilobytes is add line so basically what these plugins are all about is uh, managing files so you can uh, manipulate text files directly without any complicated for loop using these uh, batch plugins so you do not need to go into the file and do a lot of stuff in order to just change one line uh, you can basically now use one of the plugins so let's try that so we have b.txt file what i will do is i will open that file in sublime text editor okay awesome so i will keep it at one side and then we will open the folder on the other side in the screen and you can see right now we have few lines so what I will do is, I will first add a line in this file. So it's been a while I have created this plugin. So let me see how we can use it. So I will just enlarge the size of the window. And also just let's make it small so you can see everything. And now let's clear the screen first. And uh, so just to clear the screen now let's call add line dot exe basically and slash question mark to see how we can use it okay uh, defenders is doing its thing so it will not let it execute until it the scan is done and i hope the scan is done okay so we see something very weird let's try again okay so we see the, it has created a temp file let's try that with minus help okay it's not doing its thing so let's open the c file and i will do this here so it says seems like it is not working as it is okay minus h or slash question mark and i think it is not improved yet i'm just checking for the first character although okay sure sure thing uh there are some bugs always that's natural uh, okay the syntax is like call add line then the file name then the line number where we want to add the line and the new line content okay awesome so make sure that it is just adding a line it's not replacing any line for replacing a line we have another uh, plugin that is replace line so just be with me uh, let me clear the screen Let's do add line and the file name is dot dot slash b dot txt that dot dot means it's one directory behind and we have b dot txt that is opened here and I want to add a line at fourth position the line should be this is the newly added file added line sorry added line I will press enter seems like it worked but I can't see any update here but if I click on this sublime text editor it will update the file content and you can see at the fourth number we have a new line and uh, now if I will I want to add this uh, add something else at line number seven so let's say line number seven something else okay let's yeah line number seven we have something else so this is how you can simply add a line so let's do one thing let me echo on so you can see in which folder we are you can see right now we are in the add line folder let's go one directory behind and then let's go to delete line folder so we are in the delete line folder now basically in the command prompt which is this folder so i think the usage will be the same so delete line 
uh, we want to delete uh, from the file I think the usage I kept same for every file and I want to delete the seventh line that we have added okay awesome it's gone and let's delete the fourth line let's try to delete the fourth line number four and perfect so you can see we still have the same file that we had in the beginning so beginning so everything is deleted now if i go back now to read a line now uh in order to read a line particular line from the file you can also do that with the for loop but i think a plugin is much faster although we did a test and the for loop was much faster than using an external plugin to read a particular line but if you want to just read a single line and you do not want to complicate things this plugin is much easier to use and faster as well for you to write not for execution so i will go back oh cd and then i will go back go to the read line folder and then let's line let's read line number fourth which we can see it's this is a test so read line from line file number from file b.txt b.txt which line do we want to read i want to read the fourth line ah awesome we get an output this is the line this is the test and uh, second hello and let's read the fifth line which is kbc and voila it's quite fast uh the first execution takes slightly longer because of the defender uh because i just uh i i actually lost these files and any helped me find find these files again because i created them lots of months ago and then i lost them so let's not focus on that i just got them back so that's the good thing and now i'm uploading a video quickly and sharing them with all of you guys so next thing our after read line let's go to the delete line replace line folder delete we done we have added a line we have deleted a line we have read few lines from the file let's replace a line with a new one so we will say cls so replace line oh we are still in the read line so dot dot slash replace line so we are in the replace line folder now you can see here from read line to replace line and i want to replace a line from the file b.txt i want to replace the line kvc oh no, not kvc but line number five with the text abc so in the beginning as you know defender is again messing up with the file not messing but actually keeping the keeping sure that you are safe and awesome so it's replaced by abc you can also check the help i think by this which it says unknown file minus h wow so we literally you can't see the help file help menu for any of the plugins which i need to fix and i will fix it and before you will see this video on youtube i would have fixed that and uploaded the thing into github directly so you can be happily download it from there so let's do one last test let's do let's replace the last line hello with the with the bad with the thing batchman name let's say i want to replace line number 6 with batchman.com let's say and let's click on the sublime text editor awesome so it's fixed you can see it, it is doing pretty much fine and with very few errors or no errors at all i will fix the help menu before uploading the video and uh, yeah that's all pretty much thank you so much for your time and if you think uh, i can add more features or or any suggestion you have leave it in the comments and i will think about it thank you so much for your time see you in the next video 
एंड कंसिडर सब्सक्राइबिंग बाय